gonna be a radio DJ when you're done playing with that deep voice. Oh man, I have heard it <laughs> so many times. <laughs> Will, can, where, where have you seen the defense make the biggest improvement in the last couple of weeks? Obviously, you guys have had uh, back to back when uh -huh. really three games in a row, you've played really well. Uh, my, I've seen the biggest improvement probably in the back end, the DBs with their like their cover skills. Because uh, we've been working hard up front to get to the quarterback, but they've been covering very well so far. How motivating is it when you prepare this week to do everything you can to avoid the first five-game losing streak in Michigan history to Michigan State? Uh, motivating. I mean, every day since Sunday we've been in the weight room, lifting harder, putting more weight on the bar because of this week. Um, we, everybody just been motivated because we're playing. It's a big rivalry, and we're trying to beat Michigan State. I mean, what the team? Somebody grew up here to think that Michigan had lost four in a row. I mean, mm -hmm. you think that's unthinkable that you were growing up watching this? Uh, I mean, yeah, you can say that. Um, we've been. It's been disappointing to our alumni and the fans. So that's why we're going out every day trying to work hard to get it done. You probably have a lot of friends who you grew up with who go to Michigan State and stuff. Do you hear from about this from them regularly throughout the year and stuff? Um, not so much because my friends that go there or play for them, I'm kind of bigger, so <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I don't hear too much back talk from them. You said that the, you've been impressed with the secondary, but Jordan was up here and said that the biggest difference is the front seven and on the front four. Mm -hmm. um, is that just the sign of a teammate that you guys are – Trade in whoever, giving credit to the other other side. Yeah, I think that's not a great teammate um, because I I wouldn't have thought that he said that, but it's Kovac, so he loves everybody. Well, can you talk about the improvement on the front four, especially what you guys have seen out there? Uh, just us working harder with our technique, watching our man, key, uh, vi visual keys what we hear every day, just trying to do everything the coaches tell us to do. You guys have beaten Ohio State, you've beaten Notre Dame, mm -hmm. you know your other rivals. Um, what would it mean to? have finally beaten Michigan State if we can do that Saturday? Uh, we're just looking at this Saturday as another championship week, uh, another championship game. It's a, uh, a state championship game as well, but it's just another rivalry. We're just trying to play them and come out with a win. Who are you closest to on that team? And, uh, on the Michigan State team? Yeah. Uh, I couldn't really tell you. I mean, I have a lot of friends. Will Ghoston, I played with him basketball growing up. Uh, Newsom went to Renaissance, so we had a rivalry in high school too. So I mean, it's just a lot of. Are there regular close. conversations with any of those guys? Or you're not that close to any. Oh uh, no, I don't much. think I ever have regular conversations with them. Yeah. Did Did they play dirty in that game last year? Play dirty? No, they play football. Um, football is a physical sport, and we're prepared to play football as well.